Hola mis amigos, Sam Possible. I'm Miguez. My name is Tanfrey16. Welcome back to another reaction video and welcome to my seventh reaction to Phoenix Knight. So, we are starting Series 2 today. That's exciting. Series 1 had a hell of an ending with that asshole burning down the club. That was not fucking cool at all. I'm interested to see how they recover from that considering they don't have a Phoenix Club anymore. <laughs> so, I have no idea how they're going to recover. So, with, uh, Excuse me, when people were telling me about Series 2 in the comments, uh, the last video, uh, it was very mixed. It was kind of split between two obvious parties, those who think that Series 2 is not on par with Series 1, and those that think that Series 2 is better than Series 1. If you happen to be like me, and you're in the ballpark of not having yet seen Series 2, well, I guess it's time to make that distinction for ourselves. Alright, well, here we go. Series 2, Episode 1. What's going on? It's a cracking oh, it's a recap. Alright, well, if you missed the last episode, here you go. Oh, yeah. The cracking little club. Long live the Phoenix. What a dick. He fucking Lion King Scar Mufasa him. That's so fucked up. Am I recording? Yeah, we're good. Eh? There she is, Jenny. Nah. It's not much. So I see this palace. Correct. That's so fucked up, man. Are you hungry, Jerry? Oh, I can eat something. Jerry? Yeah? The club's on fire! Oh, they noticed. Is it too late? Oh, shit. That sucks. That's fucking brutal. Right back now, please, right back. That's my club, that's my fire now! That's my club burning down! Second club, too. <laughs> I don't need a suit. I've got special skin. Asbestos. The doctors are baffled. I'm a genetic freak, me. Wanker. <laughs> and me. Oh, fuck. I've got your disabled boy, Lou. Oh, 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 his little disabled boy. His face is all melted. Yeah, his hands have all melted. Your club's all melted. Jesus. Hey, you saved the chairs at least. Right, well, we managed to save your main cabaret room. Oh. But the fire started really quickly, so you've lost your other function room, your office, and your games room. Oh, Jesus. God. I think you've been really lucky. No more, no more robots? Lucky? Yeah. Lucky you! Well, if you'd have had batteries in them smoke alarms, ah. you started in the gents' toilet. There's your culprit. Too bad Keith Laird went to prison. Him? Huh? Discarded fag. Discarded fag? What's happened? Some queers burnt me club down, Leslie. Uh, well, it's a job for the fire investigation, lads, now. But if you ask me, it was started by a cigar or a cigarette. A cigar? Yeah, why? Two words, Dem Perry. Yep. Oh, shit. He already fucking knows. Bum, 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 ba -dum, ba -dum, bum, 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 Catch your ship. Wow, you gotta get up there. <laughs> That's fucked up. Oh, I made it. Where have you been? Well, I've been. I've been seeing those steps out there. Well, if you've noticed, but I'm disabled. Shh, get bent. Put you on your back. <laughs> it's a disgrace. I should sue. Well, you're lucky they're running late. They'll put you on your back. What do they want? They're your character witnesses. Then, where's Jerry and the others? I don't know, I found them all. Oh, sweet baby Jesus. Yeah, you're fucking Mother buddy. Trees are Billy Lyre and Miami Vice. <laughs> Throw the key at me. Hey, <laughs> all right. <laughs> Court is in session, all rise. I can't rise. <laughs> it's not happening. That's fair. The court calls Mr. Potter's first character witness, Mr. Kenny Dalgleish, Sr. Dalgleish? That's what you're concerned about? It's not, his, it's not a real last Dalgleish. name? Dalgleish? Where's he got that from? Guess not. Oh, no. 
Mr. Dalgleish, do you swear by Almighty God that the evidence you shall give shall be the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? Oh, yes. <laughs> Jeez, I'm going down. Yeah, you're fucked. I'm going down. Yeah. You're fucked, bud. Mr. Potter? Yes. I've considered all the evidence that has been put before me and taken into account your character testimony, your undercover military work in Vietnam, and your glittering boxing career. However, for the forging of insurance documents <laughs> and your negligence towards fire and safety equipment, it is the judgment of this court that you are no longer fit to hold a license to trade alcohol. Oh, come on! Oh! Furthermore, I have no choice but to permanently revoke your license. Bruh! No, you, you can't do that! No, no, you can't do that, your majesty! You can't take my club off me! That's all. I'm nothing without my club, don't do that! Jesus. Tell him! Do they Tell actually... Him. Do y'all actually call judges your majesty? I mean, it's your honor here, so fair enough. I didn't know that, though. That sucks. Hey, excuse me, son. I hey, fuck you. The Phoenix Club it used to be around here somewhere. <laughs> oh, all right, Brian. Didn't see you down there. Can't. You need some air in your tires, son. <laughs> what do you want? Hey, you've got a nerve showing your face around right here after what you've done. What do you mean? You? Uh -huh. That? This? This is what I mean, Perry. This? You caused all this? You asked this? Watch your mouth, Potter. That slander, that is. It's not slander. If you it's true. Don't look back in court. Yeah. He might. I heard they took your license off you. Still, at least your customers are happy. They're all down my place. Yeah, just just keeping them warm, Perry. That's all you're doing. Just keeping them warm. I'd rather be warm than well done. Oh, yes. Business is booming. Booming. Oh, Brian, just pop inside, will you? See if me jacket potatoes done. <laughs> Drive on, Terry. Have a nice day. Eh? A bit of that. Eh? Go on. Hey! Eh? Dick. That guy sucks. Well, we hope everything works out for you. Teenage pregnancy can have tragic circumstances. What is this? Louise, how did you find out you were pregnant? Well, I went to the doctors and... Don't be disgusting, you bad, bad boy. Sorry, Louise, what were you saying? Is that a well, Rod Nemo fucking parody? And that disperses the water around you, but not on you. Whoa! <laughs> Wow, that's special. No go. <laughs> Ass. <laughs> the difference with this and you won't get me well then. Umbrella hats is you simply don't get wet. The, what is this song? Uh, no. It yes, sounds uh, familiar. Where's this product from again? South America. I can't South place America. it though. Bless you America. have no best products in South America. You need it sounds really familiar though. You are in South America. If you're in the rain, it rains a lot. And they are available in rainbow platinum. Do you buy now? Not what I thought it was. Keep it inside. <laughs> he bought the hat. Learn how to hide your it sounds like something else. It's not what I thought it was, though. I still don't know what I think it is, though. Well, this is depressing. Also, he's making the same expression as the, pit, the fucking picture in the background. <laughs> Come and get your black bin bags. They're on offer till December. Oh my god. Come and get your black bin bags. Poor Jerry. They're long and black and slender. That's what she said. Heavy duty black bin bags. No matter what your gender. Heavy duty black bin bags. <laughs> Whether by our straight or bender Heavy duty black bin bags Something to remember Just rip with me, just rip with me And tear with me right now Just rip with me, and rip with me And tear with me right now Fill them up now! It's pretty catchy What are you doing? Herbal medication then For my libido I get early morning stiffness. I hope that's what it is. Who doesn't? True. What's that on your arm? It's a copper bracelet. It aids fitness and mobility. Does it? I better get two for my legs. Look, if you come here to shop and take the piss, <laughs> better both. 
you think two of my best lads have ended up like this, eh? Singing in Asda. Right, and where do you suggest we sing? Cos thanks to you, there is nowhere else, is there? What do you mean? It weren't me that burnt the club down. No, you didn't burn the club down, but it were you with your cutting corners, with your dodgy fire equipment, with your forged insurance documents. True. I had to cut corners, Jerry. It were a third club. The premiums were sky high, they were through the roof. You could have killed somebody. Ah, True. coulda, woulda, shoulda. That's different. It'll be different this time. I mean this time? I'm reopening the Phoenix. We, we're, we're going to reopen the Phoenix. You want some sort of medication? I am, Jerry. Two tablespoons of ambition, three times a day. Nice. Reopen the Phoenix? What with? You've no money, you've no licence, you've no brewery. And what's this we? What's this we're going to reopen the Phoenix? We? Me and you and Alan and the others. There is no we. Mm. We has moved on. And so has everybody else. It's time you got off your fat ass and did the same. Damn. Fat? You can't Jerry, get up, bro. Let's get some services, please. Jerry, get out. He's in a wheelchair. Happy to help, Jerry. Happy to help. Then help me. Help me, Jerry. I need you. Help yourself, Brian. Look, take my advice, will you? Stop living in the past. Forget the Phoenix. It's over. Move somewhere else. Start again. Jerry. Reopen the Neptune. Jerry! I better, um... You know. That guy looks like yeah. me. In, like, 30 years. A bit hard on him, weren't you? I can live with that. I suppose. It's for the best. That guy might be my dad. <laughs> if you're feeling rather hungry, hey, there's a product you remember. Eat it hot or cold on Sunday, or you can put it in a blender. Corn beef. With nice. chips or with salad, it's corn beef. Even Buckingham Palace eats corned beef. Hey, why don't you try corned beef hash? Nice. Lord. This looks like sad Disneyland. Depression land. That's beautiful. That color on that buildings. That's fucking awesome. Oh. What? Wait, that wasn't the same Alan, was it? I know, Alan, we went for a fish supper, took me back to his place, dropped his trousers, couldn't believe it. Anyway, he's just about to get to the vinegar strokes, and his bloody mobile phone goes off. Can I call you back, Mum? Yes, can I help? Is, uh, Hoss around? Who? Hoss. Frank. Mr. Cartwright. Frank Cartwright. Mr. Cartwright! What? Someone here to see you. What? Who? When? When? Hey, Brian Potter. What happened to your legs? What happened to your head? You were bald last time I saw you. <laughs> Cardi. Yeah. <laughs> Who committed? Like a frog up a pump. <laughs> there you are. They're happy there, isn't they? Oh, you can't go back. Well, no, I'll tell you, I'm glad I'm out of Clubland now. It's not what it used to be. See, that's why I've come here, see. Are you? Oh, well, look at me here now. See, I've got this place. I've got 69 rooms on suit. I'm making a fortune here. They don't call this the Golden Mile for nothing, you know. You know, I've got a bar, a bistro, a children's play area. I've got a sauna, a seralium, lift to all floors. Wow. If Carol's like pays out, I'm going to get a jacuzzi. Are you? I am that. Do you know what he that? The future is. I'll tell you where the future is. Are you listening to me? Future is everything under one roof. Hey, that's what it is. Look, look on there, see. Sunshine indoors. Sunshine indoors. Oh, you want to forget club, lad? Get yourself out here. Get yourself set up out here. La Ponderosa, sunshine indoors. I like that. That's very good, Frank. It's catchy. See? Well, you're forgetting I'm, I'm blacklisted, Frank. I've not got a brewery, they won't touch me. It don't matter, you don't need a brewery. What have I got here? Bottles and cans. That's all I use. It's not what they drink, it's where they drink it, see? And when you make a big success of it on your own two feet, well, the brewery will come calling back to you. Frank, I've not got a licence. Neither have I. It's Carol's name over the door, but I call the shots. Ah. What do you mean? What you need, Brian, is a fall guy. Somebody you can manipulate. He thinks it's his gaff, but it's yours. That's You're working him from behind. You see, there must be somebody 
Trust me, Brian. There's always a way. Don't think about it. Yeah. Anyway, make yourself at home here. Just enjoy all the facilities. We'll sort the bill out when you leave, all right? Who's your fall guy, Brian? <laughs> That's smart as hell, though. Mm. Oh, why was that blurry? <laughs> Why'd they blur that? <laughs> if you want to uh, change the situation <laughs> Right people, right time, just the wrong location Oh, what are they doing? They're vibing, so bro. For you. Look, you like you want me to. There's a bit of brisket already in there. Oh I've been too good to you. I tell you what, my love, I'm filling up. And I tell you what we've got today, sir. It's BSE day. Bit of something extra, right? A full bag there. I'm not asking eight quid. I'm not asking seven quid. Six quid the lot. And I tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to chuck in a pig's dick for the dog, right? Bit of a delicacy in Thailand, though, my love. Who are we having a bit of this? Who's going to... Hang on, excuse me a minute. Hello? Hello? Leslie, it's Brian. Hiya, Brian. How's it going? Meanwhile, the Legion of Doom. Nice. Whoa, 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 whoa. Stop right there. Hang on a minute. You don't just run out like that. There's nothing coming. Ah, oh, you can't be too careful. Yeah. Come on, we're going to be late. Better late than dead. We were yeah. late yesterday because you said Jackie Chan was coming to see you about some paint. He did. You missed him by seconds. He kicked an old lady in the back over there. <laughs> this will be him now. Respect the lollipop man. Kenny? Kenny seen you? Hello, Jackie. Yeah, I got you that paint. <laughs> One coat gloss. Jackie? Who the hell's Jackie? Chuck Norris wants what? Wood chip. I'll see what I can do. He's a liar. He's sick. Yeah, he's family. <laughs> Hello, Brian. Sorry about that. Through the wind and rain. Is this the way to am? Oh. We're not up in hugging my pillow. Dreaming dreams of Amarillo. And sweet Marie who waits for me. Come on, sing on. To Amarillo. I've been weeping like a willow. Poor over a willow. That's sweet for me who waits for me. You know, oh, scream. I, I know that's going to cause some people to want me to see the Peter K. Armorillo thing. Uh, the only thing about that is, I think it has Jimmy Savile in it. <laughs> so, I'd have to make some cuts if I see it. Because, yeah, I ain't showing him on here. <laughs> Right. Remember, fun is the key, but keep seated at all times or you may die. True. Shabba! Hello, Mr. Potter. Sit down! Oh, look at that, what a bloody shame. I don't know. Oh, yeah. 
What are we doing here anyway? You'll see. You know I've missed my power yoga for this, don't you? Hey. Bloody hell, look who's here! Where are you all? Oh, you all right? Hey! Right. hey. Right. I'll see you, Joe. Hi, hello. Oh, you're all here, aren't they, Ray? Paddy. Kenny. You all right? Nice, smashing. Nice, nice to see you all. It is honest. What are you doing here? Don't tell me. Brian. Yeah. Hey? I knew he'd have something to do with this. Well, let's just hear what he's got to say first, eh? Uh, well, where is he? Oh, shit. There we go. <laughs> All right, I said knock it off. Nice. Thanks for coming, everybody. I suppose you're wondering why I've gathered you here. Well, I'll tell you. Okay. Track six, you pet. Track six. <laughs> God forbid he'd be melodramatic. <laughs> I have a dream, people. I have a dream. If we build it, they will come. Build what? A what? A new phoenix. Oh, that's it. Here we go again. <laughs> Bigger, better, faster, stronger, rising out of the ashes. A super club. A king of clubs. Only this time we'll have it all. A restaurant, a bistro. We'll serve food. Food, eh? Ah, but not just any old food, Jerry. Proper food. Like Scampi, what? chicken kebs. Garlic bread. Garlic bread? Yeah. Garlic bread. That's right, Max. Garlic bread. It, it's, it's the future. I've tasted it. It is. It's and who's awesome. going to cook it? Cooks. Chefs. Us. Yeah. We'll all cook it. We'll all muck in. I can cook. You can cook and you will cook, sister. Amen <laughs> to that. We'll have a play for the kids because I believe that children are the future. Oh, garlic bread was the future. Shut up, I'm on a roll. <laughs> we'll have a cerulean, a sunbed, leisure facilities. Go on. That's it, Brian, hey. I'm in for that. That's right, that's right, lads. You know it. Sunshine indoors. Sunshine indoors. They can tan while they drink. Drink? Drink what? We've not got a brewery. We don't need a brewery. We can do it. Bolster brewery. Bottles, cans, that's all you need to run a club. Hey, and my own brew, it's one of what? Nice. It's like piss. Oh, oh, that was piss. You see, people <laughs> don't matter what they drink. It doesn't care. It's just the facilities. It's the surroundings. And they'll have it all here, all under one roof. But, Brian, we ain't got a roof. Well, we'll build a frigging roof then, won't we, Ray? We'll build one. Bit of few slates, bit of MDF. Yeah, well, you can't use MDF with it. That's being... right. That's a ticket. We'll do a change in rooms and we'll do it in half an hour. Hallelujah. You see, this rain, this rain is a baptism for the new Phoenix. But I've told you, Brian, we've all moved on. We've all got new lives. New life, Jenny. He calls singing in Asda, having a life, eh? Mm. He calls selling meat from the back of a wagon, having a life, eh? Lying to kids as they cross the road. Oh, yes. That's not living, that's just existing. You deserve better. Oh, you deserve deep. this club. This is where you belong. I can't do it without you. You can't do it, Brian, full stop. You've no licence. You've been banned for life. Ah, ah, Jerry, that's right. I have been banned for life, but you've not. Yeah, you've not been banned, have you, Jerry? You could be the licensee. Think about it. Mm. Me? Yeah, you, Jerry. You, the licensee of you the gonna new You're going to make Jerry your fall guy? That's kind of fun. I'm not getting any younger, Jerry. My running days are over. I'm handing the baton to you. They sure are. Take it. Run wild and run free. There'll be no more cutting corners now. You're the gaffer. I don't know what to say. That's true. Say yes, Jerry. Say yes to the and dress. inherit what's rightfully yours. This burnt out club. <laughs> what do you think? Jerry. Yeah, all right, yeah. yeah, ah! yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, I knew you won't let me down, Jerry. There you are, Jerry, what do you think? Nice. Nice. Just like to sign there, Jerry, on the dotted line. Mr. Licensee. Oh, yes. There you go. Oh, Brian. Oh, there's still performance? Okay. Oh, I. Oh! Next. Next. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the 
So I wonder in what direction this is going to take series two, because there's only six episodes. I wonder if it's going to take the direction of they gradually build up the club through the remaining episodes and then that's the triumphant end of the series is then with a new club or if they're just gonna do it all in the next episode <laughs> and then the rest of the series is then with a new club it's probably gonna be one or the other um so i'm interested to see how this goes i thought that was a very strong start to series two hopefully brian gets back at that asshole who pay fucking burned his club down because i mean geez i hope that guy gets his at least because he fucking should just burn his club down <laughs> I mean, fair is fair. Fair is fucking fair. But, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to do to my, for my seventh reaction to Phoenix Knights. Uh, first episode of the second series, and yeah, the rest of the series should be fun. Mm -mm, excuse me. I don't know why I can't talk right now, but that is going to do it for me today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you guys for watching. If you liked it, be sure to like it. If you didn't like it, don't. If you want to follow any of my social media links, my Twitch, rest every single day, my second channel for any views, my Twitter. If you want to follow me on my Patreon, if you want to support me on my daily motion, my video, all those things are down in the description down below. Thank you to all, as I'm currently recording, 63 of my Patreons who can support me and my channel. Uh, for those of you who don't know, you can be a Patreon on me for as low as $1 or £1. Pound. You get access to direction videos as well as to read your comments a day early and your name in the description. Also in the description is the link to community Reddit, as well as the daily schedule, as well as the Twitch VODs channel. With all that being said, though, my name is Taffer Justine, my 7th reaction to Phoenix Knights, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.